Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. How can you tell if dry yeast has gone bad? How to tell if yeast is bad, rotten or spoiled? Yeast will eventually change from a light tannish gray to a darker brown color and begin to clump together when it is getting old. Once you see these changes, the yeast has gone bad. But before that, it will probably look fine but may or may not be alive and well. Is it okay to use expired yeast? You can use expired yeast provided that some of it is still active. Yeast that's past its prime will take longer to grow and raise the dough, so only use it with breads that are made without eggs or a lot of sugar. Those bread recipes need a pretty powerful proof that weak yeast can't provide. Can I use expired instant yeast? Opened packages of dry yeast, active dry or instant, can be stored in the refrigerator for three to four months. If your yeast is older than this, it may still be good. If the mixture bubbles and develops a yeasty aroma, the yeast is still good. How long is active yeast good for? Newly purchased yeast, with good purchase by date, can be stored in a cool location, pantry or cabinet, refrigerated, or frozen for up to two years. Once the yeast is opened, it's best kept in the refrigerator to use within four months, and six months, if kept in the freezer. How long does dried yeast last once opened? Four months. Newly purchased yeast, with good purchase by date, can be stored in a cool location, pantry or cabinet, refrigerated, or frozen for up to two years. Once the yeast is opened, it's best kept in the refrigerator to use within four months, and six months, if kept in the freezer. Is expired yeast poisonous? There's an expiration, or, use by date printed on yeast, but it's not harmful after that date, it simply may be less effective. If you keep your yeast in dry, cool conditions it will last much longer than that printed date shows. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. 